stop wasting time. Here's how Smart Scout can pinpoint your next winning Amazon product in minutes. Also, if you stay until the end of the video, I'm gonna be showing you every tool that Smart Scout currently offers. I'm Josh Hackett, CEO and founder of EHP Consulting Group, and my goal is to help you become and stay a millionaire on Amazon. And the only way to do that is to conquer Amazon together. Let's dive in. Okay, so we're talking about Smart Scout in today's video, and they do have the most powerful tools, in my opinion, to do product research. Now, I do have Helium 10, Jungle Scout, AMZ Scout, and Smart Scout is the most powerful, in my professional opinion, and let me show you why. So you're gonna go to smartscout.com, go to sign in, and we're gonna go to the dashboard. The dashboard looks like this, a lot of great tools, but one of the best tools for finding new products is gonna be the subcategories tool. So they have a tutorial right here. You can just open the tool and it's gonna take a second. And then it's gonna show you pretty much every single subcategory on Amazon. So if you were trying to launch a product in the electronics category, you can dive in a little bit deeper and you can see, okay, what categories are on Amazon for the electronics? Well, they've got computer and accessories, camera and photo, home audio. What if you wanted to sell something in the camera and audio area? Now it dives even deeper to give you more ideas. What about selling binoculars? What about if you wanted to sell your own lighting studio? Printers and scanners, video surveillance, surveillance system, installation services, surveillance accessories. We've got binoculars and scopes. We got telescopes, monoculars, Opera glasses, I don't, I've never heard of that. USB microscopes, look at this, crazy, crazy different things. And what it does is it actually tells you the estimated monthly revenue of that entire subcategory you're in. Not only does it do that, it tells you the seller revenue share. So how much are sellers making? <clears throat> and then how much are Am is Amazon actually making? So you can see if you were selling, let's say digital cameras, you can see Amazon is pretty much in 21% of that category. So it might not be the best category to launch in since you're gonna be competing with Amazon. And competing with Amazon is usually a no-go because they're gonna reduce their prices and always undercut you. Now you can also see the Chinese seller revenue, which is a great option as well if you wanted to see how many Chinese sellers there are in this area. Because if there's less Chinese sellers, like only 8%, that means it's hard for them to compete and maybe they're not even interested in competing in this category because it's too difficult for Chinese sellers to create it or resell it or they don't understand the product. So this is another great thing. You can see the number of brands, the average number of sellers, the average package volume, total rating count, and a lot more. But what we're gonna do today is actually use this to find a winning product. And what I did is I thought deeply about a product, what do people use every day, right? The, if we get a product, that people use every single day, then it's gonna be a lot easier to sell and we're gonna have a higher profit margin, all that good stuff. And then I thought about showers, right? When you're in the, sh everybody usually takes a shower every day and people spend a lot of money on a nice shower head. Whenever you walk into a, a store and you see a shower head and you're like, oh, I wanna have a dual shower head or a triple shower, I want all these crazy shower head things. Uh, so we're gonna go in tools and home improvement and then we're gonna try to find some different shower heads. So <clears throat> I think it'd be kitchen and bath fixtures. And again, these are all categories on Amazon. Bathroom fixtures. And then we have bathtub faucets and shower heads. And then we have, again, shower heads. And now we have the different shower heads. So we have handheld shower heads, fixed shower heads, shower head filters, which is something I haven't thought about, and shower body sprays. But filters are actually a has been trending and I think that could be a great option as well. You can see 20% of it is Chinese sellers, 7% is only is Amazon and then the rest is regular sellers, other pretty much US based, UK, stuff like that. Average number of sell, only 238 sellers, so very niche. Shower body sprays might even be better. Look, there's only six sellers. That's crazy. So you can actually filter it by the number, the average number of sellers. And if you do that and you find a lower, low number of sellers, but a high estimated monthly revenue, that could be a great niche that you could 
launch in. But right now we're gonna do with fixed shower heads because I know fixed shower heads. And then there's, it kind of breaks down into these and you can click on products. And then it's gonna dive into this area even more and show you the competitors. Now it shows you a picture of it, the ASIN, which you can click on and then it's gonna take you to Amazon, the title, the brand, the estimated monthly unit sold, buy box, estimated monthly revenue, launch date, total ratings, rating count, some good stuff here, right? You can filter it and go through this. But what I what I notice is the launch date. If you find a product that's newly launched within the last six months and they're making an, a high amount of money, that just shows you that product is different. They're probably doing something different. You could probably dominate the market and they might not have that many competitors. But let's look at the first product first. It is a regular dual shower head, you know, very nice. And they're selling it for a premium price. I'm sure this costs them probably 20 bucks or less to create and it looks nice. Now I'm not gonna compete with them because there's already plenty of these and they're make, they already have 5,000 reviews. They're making a million dollars a month. I want something different. And this looks like it's a shower filter luxury. Let's look at this one. Luxury filtered shower headset. So this looks like a great gift item because it has a special like luxury shower filter. And like I said, filters are doing really good lately on Amazon, 10,000 sold, and they're selling it for a premium. So this looks like it's probably gonna be the easiest to sell during the holiday season. We can actually see the spike right here during December. Their sales went from 8,000 a month to 14,000 a month, like units sold and they're making around $800,000 a month on this product. So great product to sell, but again, too many reviews. I think there's gonna to be too much competition. I'm not even gonna look into it unless there was something really special about this one. But if we go to the subcategories and then we go by the launch date, we can find a better product. Before I filter it, I'm just gonna go down the list. And I see that these two have been launched in 2024 right here. It's the same brand and it's a dual shower head. And I've never seen something like this before. So it looks like it changes your regular shower head to a dual shower head. So that way you're not like, if you're shower with somebody else, you're not like fighting in the shower to try to stay warm. So I think this is a pretty awesome product. I haven't seen anything like this before. This is similar, but it's <clears throat> still mainly for one person. So if I click on that, if I click on this, so if I click on the image, it shows me a large image of it. Wow, they're making, so it says $1.2 million a month on this listing. And it, again, not much data because it looks like they just launched, but again, never saw anything like this, a tandem shower head. And this is why this, this tool is so powerful because you can really filter and figure it all out, different products to sell. I wanna see if this one is profitable. Like how many competitors do they have? That's what I wanna see. If they, have, if they don't have that many competitors, it could be an area where you could come in and then offer like a mixture of this product and a mixture of the, the shower filter product, right? Two great products, combine them into one and then dominate the market. Tandem shower, so here they are making their practically a million dollars a month. Here's another one, but this one, this one isn't the same. This one looks like it sucks but they're still making bank. They're pretty much trying to copy them, uh, but they're still making $28,000 a month. So, okay, one competitor, two, three. This one's not really a competitor because it's completely different. So one, two, three, four competitors. There's only actually five, because this is different too. 500 bucks for this. Anyway, there's only really five competitors here. So let's look at the competitors. This one's selling for 149. It looks very similar to this one and they're making 77,000. And then they, when did they launch? They launched nine, 10, 11, 12. They launched four months ago and they're making $77,000 a month on Amazon already. See, these are the niches that you need to look into. And if you have a tool like this, it's a lot easier to find like specific areas like this because you can just filter them all and most tools do not do do this so this is where it becomes extremely powerful so again my goal here if i was talking to a client would be okay let's look at the sellers let's purchase this item let's purchase this item how much better is it can we remake it and can we remake it with a built-in shower filter because that's what people want as well. They want a shower filter. And if we can make it giftable for 2025's holiday season, that's when the sales are going to spike and that's when they're gonna get the most amount of sales. So kind of have like another luxury, I'll make it a luxury item 
that's close in price to this, but still with a very, very high profit margin. And then in December of 2025, this is when you're going to dominate this area and have a lot of money and then kind of just build it out through there because there's not that many competitors. So it's really crazy to see how powerful this tool is when you can look into every subcategory on Amazon, find a niche, a niche, and then go down and then filter it by the launch date and then filter all the information. It's, it's extremely insane to see this. And if we scroll down, we can see, okay, this one's making 10, this is the one that we kind of just saw. So there we go. Who's making the most amount of money in the least amount of time. Uh, so that's where you can see new trending products and potential products that you could launch. But now, since you stay towards the end of the video, I'm gonna be showing you every product that Smart Scout currently has. And I can just tell you right from the get that one of their best tools other than subcategories is gonna be their ad spy tool. I've never seen another tool that does this. It actually spies on your competitors' ads and pretty much tells you how much money they're spending on their ads, what ads they're uh, spending money on. So you can literally copy their advertising strategy uh, word for word, which is insane, right? But now we have learning a Smart Scout University. For keyword research, we have relevant quadrant, search trends, share a voice, keyword detective, ad spy. Uh, for finding products, this is again where they shine, is gonna be the products find best selling on Amazon. They have AI listing architect, FBA calculator to see how much money you're making, sales estimator, traffic graph, and then a UPC scanner. Next for the seller, they have search all the sellers on Amazon. So if we open this up, it shows all of the sellers on Amazon, depending on the category. And you can find, I guess the, obviously Amazon is number one, but you can kind of filter it, which is pretty darn awesome. And then now if we go into brands, they have different brands, brand reports, category. This is where we saw the subcategories tool. They also have a scope tool where you can see more about that, more in-depth information. So again, extremely powerful. Your collections, if you wanted to have a collection, you can look back on and then back to all tools. So a lot, a lot of different tools here uh, that I would recommend. Some of the, a lot of them are new that I haven't seen before, uh, but I still haven't tried their Chrome extension. So that one's new as well. And again, the user whoever made a smart scout he used to work at helium 10 he left helium 10 and created smart scout so you know he knows what he's doing and what the sellers want and he's just trying to make more powerful tools from there and if you did want to try out smart scout check out the description if you click on the link in the description it's going to take you here and give you a discount also you can try it for seven days so it has like a seven day or money back so what i like to do is just try the product if it's really really good and i can use it right now then I'll keep it. But if it's not that good and maybe I can use it in the future or maybe I'm not up to date, I don't have a use for it yet, I could get your money back. But at least you learn about the tools and how to use them so when you're ready, you can execute on them. And again, there is a discount too. So if you wanted to start, uh, you can use it as a discount. But that's it for today's video. If you learned something new, drop a like below. And if you're already an Amazon seller, I highly recommend that you subscribe to our channel because we're giving away great content that's gonna help you in your Amazon journey. And of course, if you need help with Amazon product launching, talking to manufacturers, increasing your sales, whatever it is, contact ehpconsultinggroup.com in the description. We're Amazon experts and this is what we specialize in. I'm Josh Hackett, CEO, and I'm signing out.